What is up, YouTube? It is your boy ASF here, and to and today I'm going to be showing you how to use um a program I like to call um Photoshop. It's by Adobe. Obviously, you guys should know. This is just a, a um episode one of tips and tricks. It's gonna be a tips and tricks, and this today I'm going to be showing you how to make like make like modify your text and how to make it look nice your text look nice so you're gonna know what to do you're gonna open a you're gonna wanna go there well you're gonna wanna go to file open and that file open and then I have some I have a GFX pack that I, that I like to use and it's really nice actually so I'm just gonna use it for this video and it's the moon 500 pack it's really good, except for the trolls. Watch out in the pack. There's like trolls in the pack, so yeah. So I cannot put the link in the description, guys. I'm sorry because this GFX pack, it's not mine. So yeah. So you're you're not gonna want to. Some people I see some people like say. They put like a really nice text. Well, that's very good. A nice text is very good. But this whole background is like covered with something different. And what you're gonna. That's not good. Like, you shouldn't be doing that. So, there's no reason. So, what I'm gonna be doing is I'm going to teach you guys how to make your. Make it look nice without doing anything like that. So. What you're going to want to do is you're going to want to take something that you like. Say, I like this a lot, actually. So, I'm going to take that, drag that over there, put it put it over the text. And then, I want to say I want my text to be rocky. Hold on. There's no problem. Because all I got to do is right-click and hit Create Clipping Mask. And then, you find the one that you like. Which, I'm going to try over... Yeah, overlay. I'll See, that looks dope. So, what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to hit control click, and then you're going to want to hit merge layers down. Okay. So, that's the first step you're going to want to do to make it look nice. You're going to want to add a rocky texture or the to the front of your text to make it look like this. And I like to use overlay, so, yeah. The second thing is you're going to want to add a color correction. So... See, I like, say I like this color correction. I'm just going to drag that over there, onto there, and drag down to there. And then see, it makes it look like that. And that actually looks really nice. But say I don't like that, to look like that. You can switch the, these things over here to make it look different. See, just got darker. Just got darker again. Uh, Color dodge makes it lighter. Color made it darker. So I like color dodge. See that. Okay. What you're gonna wanna do is you're gonna need a black background. So I got one of my own, so just you're gonna wanna go to or the hotkey for this is at N. I mean, control N, and then it brings up this 1280 by 720. Okay, and then it just it's gonna open a new tab right over here, and then yeah, so just like that. So I don't want to make this black, and then what you're gonna want to do is you don't have to do this if you have like a grungy texture in the back that you that's like black that's in the background. Which is going to do your paint thing. Uh, just forget it. I have a grungy texture that I use. It's in a pack that I use called it's Optic Coles Street K Mini Pack. Um, it's just a little mini extra pack it has grunges in it, and it's actually really nice. So. I wouldn't use something that's not nice. Just saying. 
so I'm gonna go to wanna go to where I saved it, which is under GFX packs, and then you're gonna wanna go to three. I'm gonna go for thanks for three K, and I'm gonna go to no, not light rooms. Don't go to light rooms. And then you're gonna wanna go there. And then, well, this is for me because I don't know if you guys have this pack. So yeah, and then you can I have you click on this, and then like my personal favorite one is this one right here. So I'm gonna click on that, take that, go to the move tool, drag this over to the to the front one. It's called nice text. And then you're gonna wanna you're gonna wanna do control T and then hold just wait for it. Okay, and see and that gives you this scale thingy. Okay, once you scale that like this. You're gonna scale it under your text like that, and then you're just gonna wanna add. You're not gonna need this one anymore, so hit. Do not save that. Um, and then you're gonna wanna click that. Wait, hold on. We're just gonna see what looks nice under this. Mm. Okay, so we're gonna use these rocks right here. Okay, so what you're gonna wanna do is use that. So you're gonna put that behind there like that. And that just makes just that just adds another thing that makes it look nice. And then you're gonna wanna add another thing, like say, hold on. So you're gonna add like, not a splatter, cause those make I don't like splatter. The splatters in here. So you're gonna add this thing right here. So you're gonna take that. You're gonna drag this over to there, there. And then you're gonna wanna take this and then you're gonna wanna put it behind the rocks. And then you can take this like this. No. You're gonna wanna for me since this needs some trimming up, you're gonna want to take out the corners just like this with your eraser. And all the straight edges to make it curved. Okay, there's there we go. The first one. There's there's the first background effect that we used. Just hold on. Sorry for the technical difficulties. Well, with the sidebar thing. Okay. So there you go. There that adds just like a little bit more pop to the text. If you see what I'm. Saying, okay, and then the next thing is that you're gonna want to take like another one of these, like this. I, I like this one, and then you're gonna want to put it behind there, the text, that text, and then you're gonna want to do the same exact thing, like trim it up with the deal with the eraser before okay just like that hold on I gotta just fix this up right here 
Okay, now here's another effect that makes it look your it look just really nice. So what you're gonna want to do, you got but you guys just gotta stay with me. You're gonna wanna make, you're gonna wanna do Control J twice. It copies it, the text, and then you're gonna wanna take that over there. And you're gonna wanna put that behind the first one, and then you're gonna wanna take the opacity. You're gonna wanna turn the opacity opacity down. Down to like right about there, and then see, it like it gives like a blurred, well not really a blurred text, but yeah, a different looking texture in the back around. And then you're gonna do the same exact thing for this one. Drag that one over. Yeah, just like that. So, guys. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this commentary or this tips and tricks episode. Comment, rate, subscribe. This is ASF, and I'm going to be signing out. Peace.